Hello everyone, thank you for joining again. My name is Taylor and today I'm going to teach you how to plot using Python. So first what we want to do is open up your favorite text editor. I'm going to be using Kate today. I've already created a file called plot.py. You're also going to need a terminal to run your programs and also install the required modules. So what we want to do first is go to our terminal and type python space dash m space v e n v space and then the name of our virtual environment. I'll say plot and hit enter. Now that we have our virtual environment let's activate it by typing source space plot forward slash bin forward slash activate and hit enter. If you're on Windows you're gonna say period forward slash plot forward slash capital S scripts forward slash activate. So now that we have our virtual environment activated let's go ahead and type pip install matplotlib and hit enter. Okay if you see a message like this saying that it's successfully installed that means we're ready to proceed. Let's go ahead and clear the screen. So let me give you a little background information on what matplotlib is. Matplotlib allows us to generate graphs such as line graphs or bar graphs or any other type of mathematical graph. Now let's go ahead and proceed and import the matplotlib module. So we're going to say import space matplotlib dot pyplot space as mpl. Hit enter and then we're going to also say import random as R. We want to import random so we can generate random numbers for our data set. If you already have a data set, go ahead and use that rather than using a random generated data set. So now hit enter a few times and let's create our main function. We're going to say if underscore underscore name underscore underscore double equals add quotation underscore underscore main underscore underscore add a colon at the end and hit enter. Now let's generate our random data set. So we're going to say data is equal to open and close brackets r dot rand int open and close parentheses zero comma i. So why do we use zero to i? Well, i will always be incrementing by 1, and 0 will remain the same, and it will give us a random integer between 0 and whatever the current value of i is. So now that we have that, push space for i in range, open and close parentheses, and we'll generate 20 values. And now we can plot these random numbers. We'll say MPL, this is our variable name of matplotlib, dot plot, open and close parentheses, data. Hit enter and type MPL dot Y label, open and close parentheses, open and close quotations, numbers. Hit enter and type MPL dot X label, open and close parentheses, open and close quotations, range. And hit enter once more and type MPL dot show, open and close parentheses, and let's save this program. Let's go down to our terminal and then we'll type Python space and then the name of our file to run this program and hit enter. As you can see here are the random numbers that were generated from our data set that we created here. So here we have the Y label which are the numbers and then we have the X label which is the range. So this is a simple way on how to plot and visualize your data set. I hope you found this useful. Thank you all for watching. I invite you to subscribe and I hope to see you next time.